What is up, Jam Lee? This is Jamira Fan 2000 here with yet under the episode of Jamira Fan Talks About. This, of course, is my recurring discussionary series where I take a look at the past, present, and future of Jamira Kwai and their over 28 to 29 years of musical output. Now, we just recently had Matt Johnson just recently did, as I talked about in a recent episode of the Jamira Kwai Minute, uh, he recently did a Q&A over on his YouTube channel to uh, c- coincide with the release of his second single from his upcoming solo album, uh, first solo album, called With the Music, that's coming out in, of course, August of 2020. And one of the questions that was posed to him during this uh, live Q&A is, well, what is the status of the ninth Jamiroquai uh, album? And now, I did do a video a while back, a few months ago, um, when Matt Johnson was on his Instagram and basically made a comment an optimistic comment that he hopes to be getting back with the band very soon to work on the ninth Jamiroquai album. Um, so I thought I'd record another Jamiroquai fan talks about to basically flesh out where we are standing with the ninth Jamiroquai album. Now, as I, as I preface at the beginning of this video, um, in that Q&A, uh, Matt Johnson did give a more concise answer to why the ninth Jamiroquai album hasn't been starting to be worked on. Well, it's most notably because of COVID-19, because of the worldwide pandemic. He basically said that um, the band has not been able to get back together, but but um, hopefully when conditions get better with this pandemic, at least in a worldwide sense, um, they will hopefully get back together and start working on a new Jamiroquai album for late 20 20- to start working on the new album between late 2021 and early 20, uh, or sorry, late 2020 into late 2021. Um, from from what I from what I have seen so far over the last few months since the first time Matt Johnson kind of gave a little bit of a hint on when Jamiroquai was working start working on the ninth Jamiroquai album. Um, I really I I really don't know when or where or what rhyme and reason when the new Jamiroquai album is going to start getting worked on. Um, as I have reported in the past, there have been new songs Long listings on several music repertory websites all around the world, or at least since the middle of 2019, um, indicating that there has been new music being copyright it licensed um, on those sites. And only two songs that I've seen of these new songs have actually been confirmed on all these different music repertories. Most notably, a song called "Crazy Life," which has got is the only song of these new song listings that I've seen on worldwide repertories being listed that have a songwriting credit for every band member of Jamiroquai, literally from Derek to Matt to JK himself. But um, based off just that rudimentary information, um, the band is going to probably take their sweet time in working on the ninth album, at least for the time being. This worldwide pandemic has had more more layers of uncertainty than an onion. So, I mean, it's kind of hard to tell to give a definitive concrete answer on when they're going to start working on the album, that's really up to the band members and when they're comfortable and when things, at least in a COVID-19 pandemic sense, have been reined into where everybody is safe, or at least when there's a vaccine that's gone through clinical trials and has shown a lot of promise and shown a lot, and they've been able to mass produce it, and then everybody's able to get this vaccine, get that inoculated. Only then do I think the band will be comfortable enough to get back together at Chillington and start working on the Night Shamiroquai album. But I thought I'd record just another update noting that question that was posed to Matt Johnson concerning the ninth Jamiroquai album and assure that the jamly that the band is cer- certainly do want to get back together and work on a ninth Jamiroquai album but this pandemic has delayed everything across the world from sports to even music making so you have we all have to be patient we all have to hang in there and hopefully things will go back to a certain normal normalcy and then the band can get back in the studio, work on a new album, and then they can start hinting on their social media about that new set content. But at least the silver lining is the mem- band members of Jamiroquai have been musically active, and they have been putting out absolutely amazing music. So if you have not checked out all the new music from Nate Williams, Matt Johnson, Derek McKenzie, and of course the trio called Tronic, uh, I highly suggest you go and check all that out. It's all noted on the Art Jamiroquai subreddit if you've not got a chance to check out that new music, but check out that new music. And um, if anything happens with the Night Jamiroquai album that's of a concrete sense, that is actual concrete information, an actual confirmation, you will hear it here on the Jamiroquai Fan 2000 YouTube channel and, of course, over on the R Jamiroquai subreddit. I will keep you updated when more information about the Night Jamiroquai album of a concrete sense, not just a hearsay. If any information comes out, you will hear it in those two places. But as always, this is Jamiroquai Fan 2000. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Jamiroquai Fan Talks About. Be sure to like and subscribe. Be sure to ding the bell on your YouTube to stay up to date on all the latest new content coming from the Jamiroquai Fan 2000 YouTube channel. And I will see you again really soon with many more Jamiroquai related videos here on the Jamiroquai Fan 2000 YouTube channel. Bye bye, everybody. Thank you again all for the support and for the likes and for watching my videos. And I'll see you again really soon and stay safe.